up, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl, all things African Nana. Kissy babe. So today, kissy baby. I don't know. I don't, I, I'm not feeling okay, by the way. But thank you for always watching my channel. Always put your notification bell on so that my video notifies you. And for those who are new, subscribe, subscribe to my channel, like and share. And by the way, thank you for the 6,000 subscribers. I'll keep on thanking you guys because if it will, it was not for you guys, single one may pick up and sign Nico. So actually today I'm spicing up things a little bit. I don't want to be doing the same content each, each and every day. So today I'm doing something different. I've decided to cook something that I've never cooked on my channel. It, but the accompaniment of the spaghetti, I've never done it on camera. So today I'm doing it, and I know. Because I cook with passion, the food will, will be delicious. So let me show you the ingredients. Of course, spaghetti. That's this is how we store our spaghetti, by the way. Let me show you the yangu. So there is potatoes. Of course, these are five, four big potatoes are cut into smaller pieces. Of course, we need tomatoes. This is two tomatoes. Of course, we need the minced meat. Because we are three, we are not going to cook much of it. Of course, we need garlic and ginger, fresh ginger. This is four cloves of garlic and a, a, a small piece of ginger. And the reason why I'm using ginger, at least it will your roof, it removes that smell of blood. You know, for me, it normally has that blood, bloody smell that I don't like. So that's why I use ginger. And... We have, of course, two big onions and coriander leaves. For coriander leaves, I'm going to put musho musho. So, let's start our process of cooking, my people. And I hope all of you have been keeping well. And of course, one teaspoon of garlic powder. A half a teaspoon of turmeric. Turmeric is good for the stomach, by the way, guys. And also, a half teaspoon of black pepper. It's a must I put this because me nowadays it's a bit safe and used to spices. So stay tuned for more as I'm starting to prepare the meal from scratch. Of course, meat with ginger and garlic. That's how I'm doing it by the way. And then with a fonda ingredient. We need to boil it first so that we fry it from scratch. I know you've missed my cooking, guys. You know, but it's generally sometimes you feel like cooking, sometimes you don't feel like cooking, but it's life. So we are boiling it and then we are putting half a teaspoon of half a teaspoon of salt. Today is Monday by the way, half a teaspoon of salt. We normally love boiling my things in the boiling and soap and water. And of course we are also putting the garlic and ginger. Normally, like my you need to boil with them, small portion of it, by of course, to remove that smell. So, guys, stay tuned as I'll show you step by step. And I hope you like, I hope you enjoyed all my videos. And please feel free to suggest which kind of other videos you want me to be putting on my channel. And I'm supposed to cook samosa, I'll do that. I want to know where I'll get that man. I don't want to prepare that card. You need the nan thing from the scratch. I'll just buy the manda straight from the supermarket. So guys, stay tuned for more. Don't forget to like, subscribe to my channel, and also share. I hope you are able to see. We have already uh, this is the boiled mince meat. I had mixed it with ginger. I told you the reason why I mix with ginger. So it's, and then I start frying. I know you say about the plastic, but I know what I'm doing when I put that way. So now I'm thinking about what I do. The food. So we are going to fry from scratch. Then we put, of course, cooking oil. The minimum heat. I like using big food here. Mm. That's for lunch. Then we put our meat. I hope it's clear enough. Our bitungu. 
Of course, you know how I do my vitungu. You can choose your vitungu to be translucent, but me, I prefer mine to be golden, golden brown. And you've seen I had already put salt in my nifty, so I won't put salt again. So we'll wait for around five, three to five minutes until the the onions are golden brown. Onions have turned into golden brown. Now we put our our tomatoes. Our tomatoes. I hope you are able to see. And that tomato I have mixed them with garlic. That's how I told them to start putting my meat. So we start until they are well done. With, I like putting my spices from scratch. I feel like I love putting them like that. So this is turmeric. Of course we need to put half teaspoon of turmeric. And then garlic powder. This is one teaspoon of garlic powder. And then black pepper. Because of the lunch, I'm going to put half a teaspoon of black pepper. See no my fans of black pepper. I don't know why we love black pepper just like that. And of course, we start to our food. And by the way, happy new month to you guys. Uh, today I posted my first vlog, which was me almost getting combed in Luduri Avenue. I hope that is an experience well learned for most of you guys. And as I told you, it's good to be very keen when you're going to shop for those things when you're purchasing, because you'll get other things. And then another thing, this is a Valentine month, so happy Valentine for couples. For me, you know I'm single, but Valentine is not necessarily for couples but also for friends. So, if you are around Nairobi, you can also take me for dinner, not dinner or gift. Nakubali gift. Hey, so let me show you. Me, I love putting my spices from scratch. By the way, there are medals. You can even kuchomi. I don't want to to roast in a pan. I'm saying you put your potatoes, you know I've cut my potatoes into small pieces. You start in this mixture of onions and tomato until they mix well. And then after that I'm going to put water, small amount of water so that even. And then after that we are going to put the minced meat. The recipe is very simple. I told you guys my recipes, my recipes are simple. I'm not a chef. And I told you this year I want to go to culinary school. So that I perfect my skills. Yeah, and cooking is my passion. So stay tuned for more. Let's just put one half half cup of water for this mixture. We wait for our potatoes. Even stay tuned. Waiting for the potatoes to quiver. Uh, let, first, I'll, I'll, I'll be putting water for spaghetti. Guys, tell me how you prepare your spaghetti. Me, mine, I just boil water first and then after the water has boiled, I put the spaghetti until it is well done. After that, I drain the spaghetti, the cooked spaghetti with, with cold water. And then after that, I put it back. Then I nakaranga na mafuta or you can choose to put even kitungu. That's how I do mine. And by the that one I was inspired by my sister. Mama Solange, that's how she cooks it, and that's how I do it. There are very many, there are different ways of preparing the spaghetti. Guys, just tell me in the comment section, and I'll use your, your method the next time. So that's our water I'll put there, put there. So what I want to do, because I don't want this broth to get finished, I will add the minced, the boiled minced nini, minced meat. And then we start. It depends. This is mixed from the cow. It's beef. It's not from goat. I don't know. And then you start. Stay tuned as I'll show you the end results. And then after this, of course, wait for around 10 minutes. And then at the time, I'll put the coriander leaves. You've seen it has boiled. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do to put salt. Sorry for that. I'm going to add in salt. Let me just show you. Salt, one teaspoon, because it's a must-heat taste. 
Let me put a spaghetti. A spaghetti there. They are already cut. Just dip. And then you make sure you stir all of the spaghetti to get that water. And after that, we just cover and wait cheese in spaghetti. Because I'm not a cheese person, I'm telling you I'm so choosy in terms of food. I'm not a cheese pers person, I'll just cook it like that. Feel free to suggest or to share your ingredients on how you prepare your spaghetti and I'll use your recipe next time. Minced meat and the potatoes, now is the time we put the coriander. Now I told you I love putting my coriander the last minute. And then, of course, we stir. And voila, I think we finished. I'll show you. I'll, I'm a, and of course, my test tester is none other than Solange. She will test and she will tell us. Kama imeweza, kama haijawe. Recipe of, of miss me, that's how I do it. You can choose to put many ingredients. And that's this this how I cook mine. Spaghetti. Remember, I've not put any cooking oil. So now I'm going to drain with cold water right now. I'm using this because at least you see it has some holes. Some holes. So this is hot here. Salt and water. So this next procedure, I'm going only to need to cook it with cooking oil, but first I need to drain. This is how we do it, to drain with cold water. This process I was shown by my grandmother and also Mama Solange. This is how she does it. My hands are very clean. <laughs> of course, low temperature, and then we put our cooking oil. You can choose to cook with onions, just kidogo like that. Is okay. We put the drained spaghetti. Of course, that's not the medium because I think I do it as small and then you stir for like five minutes so that it mixes with the cooking oil very well. I finished cooking the meal of today. I hope you have enjoyed my video. Because this is the first time actually I've cooked spaghetti and missed it on camera. It's a new thing. So yeah, you need to enjoy it. Enjoy and you enjoy it with us cook eating the food. Feel free to suggest what kind of videos you want me to put. Please don't forget to like, subscribe to my channel for those who are new. We need to reach 7,000 subscribers by the end of 14th February. And for those who don't have Valentine's dates. Don't worry, even me, I'm single and I'm very happy. Stay tuned. Food, that's our dinner. I've cooked. Atambaka nimeski, I'm zrebu. Let's hear what Solange has to say. How she feels, how she tastes from the rate of one, to, between the scale of one to ten. And Tell us. Onjo to ambek, unaskiaji. Ah, we can choose to use fork like we are doing gangi. Sit in a cool of let on a jew. I said, on a scared day, chapel. How can you say how is the food? It's delicious and I love it. You love it. Yes. Recipe mengiana bizuri. Yes. I'm not a baka for lunch. I'm a summer now. So, guys, please feel free to subscribe to my channel, like and share, and also support the channel by watching the video from the start up to the end. Hot in PayPal. Remember, guys, I'm still manifesting. Actually, I've already. Um, I'm waiting for something I bought through your donation, guys. So I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting for your donation. Bye bye. Salam. Tell my people bye. Bye. Yeah.